are there good reasons to think that there is a necessary being, a being that exists of necessity and has some kind of power to produce other beings? That would be a necessary being. Uh, that's a good question. And I think really there are some good reasons to believe that there is a necessary being. Now, like any reason, I think that there is room for rational debate and rational discussion. So I don't think there are arguments for a necessary being that require people to believe in such a being. But I do think there are some some reasons that can incline and motivate a rational agreement. And uh, one reason I think this is because uh, in my own life, I went through a stage of, of inquiring, is there a necessarily existing foundation to reality? This is a very interesting question. I read various books and articles, discovered arguments that led me to believe that there is a necessary being. And I know others who have a similar story. Also, I set up a website called NecessaryBeing.net, and this website is a survey that actually asks people what they think about various premises and arguments for a necessary being. And so I wanted to test, do people who don't believe in necessary being find intuitively plausible any premises in various arguments for a necessary being? And the results were extraordinarily intriguing. More than 90% of people who said no to the question, is there a necessary being, reported premises that um, from which you can construct the argument that there is a necessary being. And several people even emailed me saying that they were persuaded by the argument and now they want to find out more about the nature of this necessary being. And again, I mean, I do want to emphasize, I don't think that the arguments are rationally compelling. So for example, one uh, a philosophy professor who took the uh, quiz, he says no to the necessary being. He took the quiz, he reported answers that entail a necessary being. And he saw that that was very interesting to him. And that actually motivated him to go back and more carefully see why this tempting premise was one that he rationally should give up because he has independent reasons he takes to deny a necessary being. And I think that's perfectly rational. But on the other hand, if you know you haven't thought about these things, these arguments can really invite you into a, a new kind of inquiry. And in my experience, most, um, most people are just not aware of most arguments for a necessary being. So yeah, I do think there are some reasons for a necessary being that can be persuasive to people.